Good evening and thank you for joining us. Vancouver police have shut down a makeshift nightclub that was playing host to dozens of partiers inside a penthouse apartment. More than 70 people have been fined and the host arrested while the event was in full swing. Alyssa Thibault is following this for us tonight. Alyssa, police say the host is a repeat offender. Yeah, and we were told today, so this is not the first time this 42-year-old man has hosted parties in his three-level penthouse apartment. This latest one, police say there were 78 people inside when they arrived in the early hours of Sunday morning. All guests have been fined $230 for violating the COVID-19 restrictions and, as you mentioned, the host arrested. Now, police do hope this will be a wake-up call. We take it very seriously and, and uh, as I said, we're not messing around. And uh, this should be a warning to anybody out there who thinks that they can get away with this. Uh, we will enforce the public health order. So this is allegedly the third party held in this apartment on Richard Street. There was another on Friday night, also last weekend. So there are fines for all three. Now, police say each event included menus, point of sales terminals, even a doorman. We did speak with some neighbours today, clearly in shock that it happened again. Yeah, he's pushing the envelope. I can't believe he's still at it. But as far as I know, he got a fine last week and he didn't obviously didn't care enough, so he yeah. done the party again. I mean, I think we were here on, what day was it? Friday and there was at least 100 people standing outside here trying to get in. And if he said this young man, he told our crews that he has actually been evicted from this same building. He says that was for having 11 people over to his apartment for a birthday party earlier this month and he was moving out today. We also heard from the public safety minister this afternoon. It's outrageous that this individual felt that they could uh, flaunt the rules and um, hold an illegal rave and that there would be no consequences. This may well be just the beginning of the, of the penalties and charges that uh, these, uh, these individuals face. So just on those penalties that he mentioned there, Minister Farnworth tells me that this man could be facing up to a year in jail, even fines from the city of Vancouver if he is found to have been running an illegal business operation. But as it stands, just this most recent party has cost $17,000. Nafisa? All right. Thank you, Alyssa.